Why do you look for the living among the dead? He is not here, but has risen. Friends, that's the first ever, and not just the first ever, the best ever Easter message right there. Yes. And all these years later, 2,000 years later, not one single thing needs to be added to it, taken from it, changed one single bit about it to make it any better. He is not in the tomb. He is risen. He is not dead. He is alive. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. For sure. It's been said that um, the huge rock that was rolled in front of the tomb of Jesus... Really, in perspective, it was just a teeny tiny little speck of dust. Just a little pebble when compared to the real rock that was on the inside of that tomb. I love that line. Just think about that. Yeah, the, the, the rock, the huge rock rolled in front of that tomb was just a speck of dust compared to the solid rock, the rock of ages on the inside. Yes, the rock of ages, King Jesus. He could not be held by the rock in front of the tomb. He could not be held by the tomb itself. He could not be held by the power of Satan, sin, death, darkness, or evil. None of that, nothing and no one were or are strong enough to restrain and to contain the resurrection power of Almighty God Himself. 